Okay, Poon, good afternoon again. Finally, we're here. <laughs> good afternoon. There's a, you know, uh, mistake. Okay, so, by, but anyway, let's have our topic, okay? Okay, Poon, will you please read our topic, Poon? The passive, present simple. Okay, we are going to this, uh, tackle about the passive voice. Okay, this is the passive voice. And we'll be concentrating on the present simple. We have uh, many tenses, right? The present simple, past simple, the present perfect tense, present continuous, past continuous, and so on and so forth. But the passive voice that we are going to learn now is the present simple tense, okay? So here is the structure of the passive voice. But I want you to, uh, I want to discuss to you the active voice, okay? You don't have the passive voice if you don't have the active voice, okay? For active voice, the structure is subject plus the verb plus the object. Okay, so I have here a sentence. He opens the door. Okay, our subject here is uh, he, which is a singular pronoun. And the verb that we have here is opens. There is an S because our subject is singular. Okay, and the object is the door. Okay, do you understand? Subject plus the verb plus the object. That is the active voice. So let's go to passive voice. If we are going to uh, make a sentence in passive voice, okay? The object in the active voice will become the subject in the passive voice, okay? And the verb you are going to use. We are uh, discussing or the topic is present simple. That's why we have the verb to be in present uh, form, okay? So, but the verb should be in the verb three or the past participle. Do you understand? And the subject in active voice will become the object in passive voice. And we can use the word by. So in a, in making a sentence, we have to change the subject. He is our subject. You will not say by he, but you're going to say by him. Okay, the example of a sentence is, the door is opened by him. Wait, uh, I hope you can follow our discussion. Okay. Oh, this is in your book. Look at the example of the passive in blue in the text. Okay, the blue in the text is, is used, okay? Then read and complete the rule in the learn this box. Okay, you have to write this one. It is used. So this is in a passive voice. Is verb to be present. And of course, the past participle is used. Okay, will you please read Haruka? Haruka, will you please read? I just found deep under the ground. It is from, from tiny plants and animals that live in the sea millions of years ago. Oil has many uses. It is used to power vehicles such as cars, planes, and trains, and many plastics are made from oil. Scientists believe that global warming is caused by burning, by the burning of oil and other fossil fuels. So they are trying to develop alternative sources of energy. Okay, thank you. So we have here a text, the very short text, but in here you can find some of the passive voice, okay? 
I underlined uh, all of them. So we have here, oil is found deep under the ground, okay? Oil is found deep under the ground. So what is the present simple of found? Un. Un, what is the, uh, the present simple of, uh, sorry. Oh yeah, the present simple of found. Um, fine. Okay, fine. Very good. And we have here, many plastics are made from oil by cow. What is the present simple of made by cow? Make. Make, of course. And global warming is caused by the burning of oil and other fossil fuels. Okay, Grace, what is the present simple of cost? Grace, are you there? Cost. Cost without D. Okay, very good. So we continue. So in here, you have to, please write, is used. The present passive is formed with the correct form of the verb is used, okay? And the past participle. So the verb, uh, the, the form of the verb to be is is, and the past participle is used, okay? So we have here uh, three example of the sentences. Poon, will you please read number one? Poon. Poon, can you read? These stories are made in Sweden. Okay, so we have here, uh, these stories are made in Sweden. We have here, of course, for passive voice are made. Okay, uh, second one, Bahaluka. Mobile phones aren't sold in the shop. Okay, aren't sold in the shop. Okay, what is the present simple of sold, Bahaluka? Sell. Sell, very good. By cow, for the third sentence. Is this book printed in China? Okay, this is an interrogative sentence or a question. Can you make it a, a positive sentence or a declarative sentence, Grace? Grace. Hello, Grace. Is this book printed in China? So can you make it in declarative or a positive sentence? This book. This book is printed in China. Okay, very good. This book is printed in China. So students, we have here the verb to be present. And then the uh, verb here is past participle. This is very uh, easy. But you have to remember the structure of passive voice. So when we want to say who performed the action, we use by, okay? So we have here the sentence, these cars are, are built by robots, okay? If we are going to make it in an active voice, what will be the sentence, Haruka, for active voice? Robots. Okay. These cars. Robots. Robots build these cars. Okay, very good. Robots build these cars. So that is the active voice, okay? So let's continue. Okay, I have here an example. Okay, let's have an exercise so that you, you uh, will understand more the usage of the passive voice in a sentence. Okay, I have here number one. He writes a letter. Poon. Poon. Can you make it passive voice? He writes a letter. Poon. Remember that in active voice, he is the subject, right? Right is the verb and a letter is the object. In passive voice, you are going to make the, uh, the object as the subject, 
okay? And of course, you are going to use verb to be present. And the past participle of the verb. And the subject will be the object for passive voice. Okay, Poon, will you please try? Uh... A letter. Oh, a letter is written, uh, write, written by him. Okay, so a letter is written by him. So we use by. We, uh, it, it's okay if you will not use by, okay? But uh, if you want to use, you can use it by him. Okay, so let's continue. By cow, will you please read? By cow. By cow. Hello, by cow. Are you there? The okay. company. Hires. Hires new employee. Okay, will you please make it in passive voice? By cow. Um, new. New okay, go employees on. is okay. Uh, remember that the the subject is plural. So what are you going to use? New employees. Right now. Are you going to use is or are? Are. Uh, okay. Please continue. Uh, hired by the company. Okay. Are you going to, to add uh, D or not for our verb? Like yes. Okay. Yes. So the passive voice sentence is new employees are hired by the company. Okay. So Grace for number three, that's, this is for you. Grace. She delivers. She delivers the magazine. Okay, please make it uh, in a passive voice. The magazines are delivered. The magazines, by... okay, are delivered by? She. By she? No. Her. Her, of course. The magazines are delivered by her. If you're going to make a sentence, you should look at the, uh, the subject because it depends upon what are you going to use for your verb. Should be with S or you are going to use is or R, okay. And for this one, okay, this is very easy. Please get your book and um, answer this one. So do you, want, do you want to answer this by your own? Or do you want my help? This is very easy. You can answer this, okay? I just read all of the, uh, the sentences. Okay, for number one, uh, exploit one, choose the correct words to complete the sentences. Okay, let's have this one so that you can uh, understand our lesson. Computers is, are used in most schools. What will be your answer? Just underline your, your answer in your book. And then of course, you should write your name, take a photo and send it to our line group, okay? For number one, computers is, are used in most schools. Number two, coffee is, are grown in Kenya. Coffee is, are grown in Kenya. Okay. For number three, the Olympic Games is are watched by millions of people around the world. The Olympic Games is are watched by millions of people around the world. Okay. For number four, plastic bags. Isn't aren't provided 
the customers in our local supermarket. Plastic bags is sent, aren't provided to customers in our local supermarket. Okay, finish students. You just um, choose from is or are for our present uh, for verb to be. Okay, let's continue. Okay, we have the answers. If you are in, uh, wrong, don't be honest, okay? Be honest, okay? We have here computers are used in the schools. For number two point, what is your answer? Please read again the sentence and your answer. Coffee, spoon. Coffee is grown in Kenya. Okay, let's see if you are correct. Okay, coffee is in singular form. So number three, by cow. By cow number three. Um. What is your answer? The Olympic Games are watched, watched by, watched by okay, millions of people around the world. Okay, you are going to pronounce this W-A-T-C-H-E-D in uh, past simple. Watch, watch, not watch it, okay? So you are correct by cow because the answer is R. Okay, that's why games are Plural. Okay. For number four, Grace. Hello, Grace. Plastic bags aren't provided the customers in our local supermarket. Okay, of course, because pl plastic bags is plural, so you have to answer errand. Errand provided the customers in our local supermarket. Okay, let's continue. So again, answer Arabic S are spoken in Algeria. Arabic S are spoken in Algeria. Number six is wood is are used to make paper. Wood is are used to make paper. Number seven. Millions of items is, are both and sold on the internet every day. Millions of items is, are both and sold on the internet every day. And for number eight, Paris is, I know, at the city of light. Paris is, I know, at the city of light. Okay, let's have by cow. Oh, sorry, Aru Haruka for number five. Arabic is spoken in Algeria. Okay, very good. Arabic is singular. Okay, for number six, phone. Wood is used to make paper. Okay, wood is used to make paper, of course. For number seven, Grace. Grace. Millions of items are bought and sold on the internet every day. Okay, very good. Millions of items are bought and sold on the internet every day. And of course, for number eight, for you, Baikal. Harris is known at the city of light. Okay, very good. Paris is known at the city of light. Okay. Poon, uh, what is the present simple of spoken? Speak. Okay. Uh, Haruka, present simple of used. Use. Okay. Grace, present simple of both. Bye. 
Why? Very good. This is irregular verb, okay? And also speak, irregular verb. That's why the, the spelling is changes. And then for you by cow, no. 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 No, okay. So I hope you are correct with your answers. Okay. So are you done? Please don't forget to send it to our line group. Okay, we're not yet done. Okay, again, you are going to uh, make a passive voice or an active voice. Okay, for this one, let's call on Haruka. Please read the active voice first and then make a passive voice. You watch the card every week. Okay. Uh, the car is washed, washed, washed every week. Washed every week. Okay, every week. Okay. You can use again passive voice without using by. Okay. The car is washed every week. Okay, we have here. The passive voice, you are going to make it in an active voice. Grace. Will you please read a sentence for passive and make it, uh, make your se a sentence for active? Grace. Hello, Grace, are you there? Um, yes. What will be, okay. Will you please read, uh, read first the, the passive voice? TV. This TV is washed by him in the evening. Okay, so what will be the active voice for this? What will be your he, subject? Uh huh. He washes TV in the evening. What are you going to use in a uh, in your verb? Are you going to to use the past simple or the present simple present. or or the past participle? Present simple. Present simple. So your 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 verb should be watch or watch with ed or without. Grace. Watch. Without ed. Yes or no? Yes. yes. Okay. He watches TV in the morning. Why watches? Boon. Boon, why watches? Why is it watches? Not because, watch? he, because he is a subject that is singular. Okay, very good. Because our subject here is he, which is singular. So you are going to add es. Watches. Very good. Baikal, will you please read the third sentence for active voice and make it in a passive voice? We we'll build our house. What will be your passive voice? Our house. Wake up. Our house are built by. Okay, by cow. Our subject is our house. Is... So what are you going to use? Is or are? Is what is the past participle? Come again. What is the past participle of build? Build. Okay, build. Let us see. Our house is built. You can use by or not. Okay, it's it's uh, both correct. So for number four again. Okay, one. One. The apples, the are, apples eaten. are eaten by them. Okay. What will be your they, active voice? They eat. Oh, sorry. They eat the apple. The apples. <laughs> oh, okay, sorry. let's see. One. They eat the apples. Okay. So uh, you are just confused, okay. So, 
Okay, let's uh, do it. For passive present, this is very easy. Page 113, will you please open your book to page 113 and we have to answer this. Complete the sentences with present simple passive form of the verb in the brackets, okay? For number one, we have grow. The verb in number one is grow. Rice blank grow in China. So what will be your answer? You have to, the first activity that you have is only the verb to be. Now you are going to write the verb to be and of course the past participle for passive voice, okay? So for number one, the verb is grow. Number two, where? And number three is speak. First sentence, rice blank, grow in China. Number two, helmet blank wear by ice hockey players. Number three, Spanish blank speak in Mexico. Okay, finish. Okay, Haruka, what is the first uh, sentence? Rice is grown in China. Okay, very good. Is grown. Very good. Let's have uh, Grace. Grace. Uh, Helmet. Wow, by ice hockey players. Okay, what is your past participle? Grace, where, where is our uh, verb? Uh, w, please spell it. W -O, -R -N. o R N. O R N. So let's see if you're correct. Very good. Worn is the past participle of where, and the past simple is war, right? W O R E. So for number three, uh, Baikal. Baikal for number three. Spanish is spoken in Mexico. Okay, very good. Spanish is spoken in Mexico, of course. Spoken is the past participle of speak. So by a point. Coffee, blank, drink in most countries of the world. Okay, please answer this first. English, blank, teach in school in Jordan. In schools in Jordan. And number six, noodles, blank, eat in China. Are you done, Poon? Okay, please answer number four. Coffee is dr dr drunk in most countries of the world. Okay, world. What, is your, what is the spelling of your drunk? D-R-U-N-K. Okay, let's see if you are correct. Of course, because the past simple is one. What is the past simple of drink? Drunk. Drink. Drink. D-R-A-N-K, okay? And this is the past participle, D-R-U-N-K. Okay, very good. And let's call on Grace. Hello, Grace. English it is taught in schools in Jordan. Okay, so this is uh, irregular is taught verb. Yes, very good. Uh, Grace is taught, okay? Is taught in schools in Jordan. Okay, and for number six, uh, by cow. By cow for number six. Noodles are eaten in China. Okay, noodles are eaten in China. Why did you use uh, R? By cow. 
Why did you use are? Because noodles have this. Singular plural. Plural, of course. Very good. Oh, sorry. <laughs> but anyway, that's the end of it. So uh, I want to call you, everyone, and give me an example of a sentence using the passive voice. You can, uh, uh, you can make an active voice and then make, uh, make another, of course, the same sentence, but you have to, uh, you know, to uh, arrange the words in passive voice. But if you can do, if you can make a passive voice already, you can do it, okay? So you're on before. We have uh, Haruka first. Yes. Please give me a passive voice sentence. The cake is eaten by her. The cake is eaten by? By her. By her, okay, very good. So what is your, uh, what is the, the past participle of your uh, sentence? Uh, eaten. Eaten, okay. Juan, how about you? Can you make a sentence? Um, the car, is driven by, 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 by her. <laughs> the car is driven, not driven. Okay, cool. The car mm -hmm. is driven by her. You are correct. Very good. And also Haruka, very good. Good job to both of you. How about you, Baikal? Baikal. Uh, water has drunk. By. Is is drunk? The water by, is drunk by by Poon. By Poon, okay. And for Grace, Grace, can you give me a passive voice? A uh, homework is done by me. Okay, our homework is done by me. Okay. Students, uh, please send your uh, activity online in our uh, line group, of course. Don't forget to write your name. I'm checking your activities, okay? So uh, please review the lessons because every lesson that we take or that we took is part of your final exams, if you have final exams, okay? So thank you very much, everyone. Uh, happy weekend to all of you. Stay at home. If you don't have to go out, okay, because you know the our situation is uh, not okay. Okay. So, but continue studying, of course, and keep safe. Okay. Thank you very much to all of you and goodbye. Bye-bye.